Hello guys, in this video I'm just going to explain how to configure PSP screen resolutions as 4K in OBS Studio. For example, you might be using different capture cards like Elgato or Avermedia, but still if you want to configure in OBS and you want to do live streaming or you want to record the game, you can easily do it in OBS Studio. OBS Studio is a powerful tool, already we knew that. Even right, I am using Avermedia Gaming Capture but I will not use this every media uh, to record the game of uh, live streaming because I will be using OBS Studio or Streamlabs. Even right, if you have Elgato Capture Card, you can configure it in OBS Studio. Also, you can see the less resolutions. I mean, I think 1080 pixel. I'm using 4K monitor, but you still you can see this. There is some lag in the resolutions. I'm going to configure it in 4K. Already, I have added the capture device. So here, double click. And here you can see this. I'm using AV Media Capture Card, it's a 4K Capture Card, but still 1080 pixel resolutions because we need to configure. Because by default, OBS right will take 1080 pixel. So here we need to choose resolution FPS type. So by default, it will be device default. So I need to change it to 4K. So I'm going to choose custom, and the resolution is going to be uh, 4K. You can choose whatever you want, even you can set it to 2K resolutions and even 1080 better resolution with 60 fps also you can change it okay i'm going to choose this uh, 4k resolutions you will see this improvement here in the resolutions so fps should be uh, 60 fps okay this video format i'm going to change it to x or gb just you can uh, play around with a different color space sorry a different video format even me12 so me12 is better and uh, here y u y2 that also better nv12 is actually better i can see the difference here video format if i change right x or gb that is less resolutions but i'm going to change it to uh, nv12 okay and here the color space right i'm going to change it to 709 super and the color range i'm going to make it full all other settings are fine. Uh, even right, you can just I mean, increase brightness. So click on this configure. So here you can see the difference. Uh, here we need to go to video proc. And here, if you want to increase the brightness, you can increase it. If you want to increase the contrast, you can do that. Also, you can increase the sharpness. So give a play and then OK and give OK to these properties. That's it. Super cool. Now you can see the difference. The perfect 4K resolution is set on OBS Studio. So if you have open AV Media app or Elgato, just close it because that gaming capture also will be trying to direct your PS5. So if you have opened the app, Elgato or AV Media, just close it. Whatever the app you have opened uh, related to your gaming capture. Now you can see the better perfect uh, 4K resolutions in OBS. So these are the settings, just go through, okay. Here you can see there is no laggy in this icon also, before it was there. Even these letters also was blurred. Now it's fine, perfect and crystal clear. So these are the settings, just do it. Also verify your overall OBS Studio settings. Go to settings here, uh, we need to choose this output. In recording here our graphics card should be selected the recording format should be mp4 and the rescale output should be disabled and CBR for rate control and uh, bitrate we can set 40,000 to 45,000 and this preset is quality and uh, go to video and base resolution is 4k output is 4k and uh, 60 fps and filter as lag source and then advanced rate Process priority should be above normal and color format should be NV12 and color space should be 709 and color range should be full. So now it's crystal clear 4K resolutions in OBS. Hope you can see the difference as well. So this is the way you can set 4K resolutions for your PS5. Now you can stream in 4K mode to YouTube, uh, Twitch or Facebook gaming. Even you can record as a 4K. That's it friends, hope this video is very much helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Please spread the comments and feedback from media forms. Thank you, bye and take care.